But right now, let's move on and get to another development. In fact, in a significant development in the Supreme Court, the Modi government has opposed the push to bring political parties under the RTI. The center has told the top court that political parties cannot disclose their internal functioning and financial information under the Right to Information Act as it will hamper their smooth functioning. Now, the government also said if parties' internal information is out, then political rivals can take advantage of it. In short, the interest of political parties has been put above the public's interest. The petitioners had advocated greater transparency and accountability for political parties by subjecting them to the RTI. Now, the centre said the Chief Information Commissioner's orders can't be the basis of change. Earlier, remember, the CIC had declared all national and regional political parties as public authorities under the RTI in its 2013 order. In March this year, it had reiterated the order as final and binding. The Supreme Court had earlier issued a notice to six national parties, including the Bharatiya Janata Party and the Congress, asking them why they can't come clean and disclose complete details of their income expenditure, donations, funding, including donor details, to the public under the RTI Act. All the political parties under the Right to Information Act and uh, the uh, petitioners, uh, several petitioners including the Association for Democratic Reforms uh, led by Prashant Bhushan, uh, activist Prashant Bhushan and another senior lawyer, uh, 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 Gopal Shankar Narayanan said that there are two uh, Central Information Commission uh, orders uh, which have declared all political parties as public authorities and said that they be brought under the Right to Information Act uh, in the interest of greater transparency, uh, greater transparency and accountability towards uh, the public who look forward to them in every election. Uh, but uh, the uh, Solicitor General Tushar Mehta uh, said that uh, uh, the CIC order cannot be the mere basis for uh, the Supreme Court to uh, issue a direction uh, to the centre uh, to uh, for any legislative amendment to bring this rule of uh, bringing these political parties under the ambit of RTI and uh, and it requires more. Uh, and remember, the, uh, even earlier, as you rightly put, the centre had filed an affidavit opposing any move to bring the political parties under RTI, saying that. Um, uh, financial, inf uh, financial information and internal functioning details cannot be revealed as it affects smooth functioning of a political party because the, uh, p the uh, particular party's rivals may take advantage of it uh, electorally uh, the, uh, and uh, no party will like to, uh, uh, p uh, in fact, project or uh, bring to public its weaknesses or, or strengths. Uh, so these were the arguments. Uh, by the Solicitor General and the, and the Centre.